School will be back in session tomorrow at Johnson Junior High following three missed days because of a mercury spill. We have yet to hear of this spill seriously sickening anybody, but how common is mercury poisoning? Contact 13 investigative reporter Stephanie Zeppelin found out. A doctor here at UMC tells us liquid mercury, like what kids are telling us they found at school, is a less dangerous form. Dr. J.D. McCourt says elemental mercury, like the liquid found in thermometers, is less dangerous than other kinds. And how dangerous the substance is depends on the exact chemical. If you're exposed, symptoms can range from random tingling to headaches. But Dr. McCourt says mercury poisoning here is very rare. Offhand, I don't know of anyone who's seen a mercury toxicity here. And, and what we do see is the child brought in after they bit the uh, thermometer. And, and again, that's really not a, that's the elemental mercury that's really not uh, uh, very toxic. He says it's more common to see mercury poisoning in areas where there's industrial and metal work. Stephanie Zeppelin, 13 Action News.